I'm very well. Now, Joe, <laughs> since we last met, not only have you gone on to win another talent show, you yeah. great big winner, you. <laughs> Is there anything you can't do, Joe? I didn't really realise how hard it was going to be yeah. until I actually got the first rehearsal. I was thinking, I'm just going to pretend, you know, make it make a loud noise, and, and <laughs> you know. And then when I realised I actually had to change the breathing and everything, I was like, oh. What kind of loud noise? Well, you know, like <laughs> pretend to be an opera singer. Oh, you know, right, I put on that kind of fake. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Good thing. Well, not that. But <laughs> <laughs> We would have got very far. <laughs> all right, well, listen, Joe, we could uh, chat to you all day, but we like to do things a little bit differently around here. Okay. Yes. So, instead of us interviewing you, we are going to give that job to our lovely studio audience. Now, don't worry, they're not as scary as they look. Are you up for the challenge, Joe? I'm up for it. Excellent. Let's be going. Okay, then. here we go. All right, who's got a question for Joe? Put your hands up. Put your Come hands on, up. Come on, Sam. Okay, we've got some questions over here. Come on, Sam, quick. Come huh. huh. Waiting, 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 waiting. Okay, down here. Stand up, mate. What's your name? Oliver. Oliver, what's your question? How well do you know Cheryl Cole and do you have her number? I do I know her very well and I do have her number. But it's saved under a different name for the very reason that people like you would probably try and get out. <laughs> to be fair, you can't blame me for trying. Yeah, exactly. Mate, we'll try and do it for you after the show, okay? Thanks. Nice. Okay, who else has got a question? Down here, here we go. Excuse me, excuse me, coming through, coming through, coming through. Stand up, mate, what's your name? Graham. Graham, nice to meet you, Graham. Hi, Joe. What's Hello. Your question? If you were to compete in the London Olympics, what event would you do and why? Cracky so question. Um, well, I used to be on the swimming team at school. And I was always quite good at swimming, so probably swimming. Oh, di I like diving. Oh, okay. Di maybe diving. Diving? Oh, you'll be up against Tom Daly, though. Okay, maybe swimming. Okay. <laughs> okay, thank you very much. Okay, who else has got a question? Okay, we're going up here, we're going up here. Right. Why are we here? Stand up. What's your name? Angela. Angela, lovely to meet Angela. What's your question for Joe? Well, actually, can I ask you a question? Of course you can, yeah. Why isn't it Mark and Sam? I think that sounds better. <laughs> What's your name? Ellie. Ellie, what's your question? Um, do you ever Google yourself? Um, no. I try, I try not to. I mean, it's quite, it's quite hard because you could easily just go and what your name is and see what people are writing about you, but it, I try to keep separate away from that because some people write horrible things and some people write nice things and it gets a bit messy. So, I try not to. Interesting. Ask Mark if he Googles himself. Do you Google yourself? Every day. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much. Okay, who's next? Who's next? Okay, the next row. Here we go. Here we go. Okay, down here, down here. Okay. Shh. Oh, there they go. Hey, stand up, stand up. What's your, what's your name? Josie. Hey, what's, what's your question for Joe? Um, have you ever met anyone you've always wanted to meet since being the X Factor? I haven't met her properly, but she said hello to us, and I was very starstruck with Beyonce. Wow! Yes. I bumped into her at a festival, and I turned into a bit of a fanatical fan. Good effort there, Sam. Nice work. Uh, Joe, thank you for letting our studio audience in for you. Questions. Ladies and gentlemen, give it all for the brilliant Joe McKeldrick. <laughs> music than you are in luck because later on in the show 6D will be performing but now it's time to turn the spotlight onto another member of the studio audience. Here on Wind Up we are partial to a bit of birthday fun. Hey, who doesn't like a birthday? It's a whole day where you are the star of the show and we want to celebrate that. The only thing is we ain't got a whole day. Yeah but don't worry we've come up with a solution to this problem because we are about to give someone in the audience today the world's quickest birthday party. Indeed and that person it's you, Elliot! Yeah, I need you! Are you having any problem at all with any vision? No. No, do you have any troubles uh, recognising?